guys. Well, you know, I'm always the first one up, this Elena. Uh, you know she pregnant with twins, so she up all night using the restroom, drinking water. And so I get about six hours sleep, seven maybe. Went to sleep at one, got up at seven, six hours. So I'm gonna make some oatmeal here. We gonna come over here, you know what I'm saying? Got the pot over there. So where my beaker at? I need my beaker. Where my beaker? Beaker in here and a dishwasher. Yeah, got that dishwasher. Do y'all use a dishwasher or you wash your dishes? I do both. I prefer to wash. I don't like using the dishwasher. So we're gonna come over here and put two cups of water in there. Yeah. Put that water up in there. And so I fill it up to that point. Then we come over here. We got our pot. Put that in there. Then we let that boil, okay? So when it comes to a boil, what I do is I put two cups, no, excuse me, a cup and a half of oats. And this is old fashioned oats. You put a cup and a half of oats to two cups of water, all right? Then once the water boils, we put it in there. Be back with y'all. I want to say good morning to the people. What time is it, Bruce? 8, 11 a.m.? What time do you usually get up, Bruce? You be up about 8, 7, huh? You got about 7 this morning, huh? Say hi. Say hi, Bruce. Brucey, say hi to the people. Oh, you like it. He's like, I'm still sleepy. Leave me alone. You sleepy, Bruce? Nah, you're not sleepy, are you? Water is boiling. You see that? The water is boiling. So we're gonna take our cup and a half of oats. There it is, see it? Put it up in there. All right? Now we're gonna stir it. You know, this is the only thing that Helena likes uh, my cooking. <laughs> she don't like the top ramen. She don't like no other cooking of mine except my oatmeal. So, you know, I feel honored. So now I'm gonna get my uh, cinnamon. Come over here and get the cinnamon. Do y'all use cinnamon for your oatmeal? You should, it's healthy. So we're gonna uh, put a little of that. Not much. You don't wanna oversaturate it or make it too cinnamon or spicy. So you see it's foaming up now? So what you gotta do, you gotta take it off the fire. Take it off the fire. Let it simmer down, see that? See it simmer down? Then you put it back, lower the fire a little bit, and then we let it marinate. If you like it more wet, more dry, you fix it to your liking. So we we'll see you guys in a little bit, all right? All righty. Okay guys, the oatmeal is done. And today, texture, every day is different. Some days it's drier, some days it's wetter. Today it's a little wetter. And uh, I do use cane sugar to sweeten it. So we're not gonna put much. Let me show you guys how much we're gonna put. We're not gonna put much. Then we stir it up and we get ready to serve. And usually I just put Helena's in the microwave. Uh, I let mine cool off. I actually put a little peanut butter in mine, but she put fruit in hers and uh, you know, she'll show you later. With that, I hope y'all enjoyed this segment of it, this portion, the first portion of what we eat in a day, or what she eat pregnant in a day. So she start off with oatmeal with some fruit in it. See y'all in a little while. Good morning. Oh my God, my baby is so sweet. So he makes oatmeal for me every morning, I'm pretty sure. He already showed you guys how to do it. Um, so I wake up a little bit later, but it's still warm. So this is my breakfast. It's about like a cup, maybe two cups of oatmeal. Um, what I like to do is, I like to add my banana to it. Not a whole banana because it makes it just so much, you know. So what I do is uh, I put one banana or half a banana in here. Cut that up. Morning, Bruce. 
Hi, Brucey. How are you? Come here. Come on. <laughs> you don't want to say hi? So yeah, I put my half a banana in here. Hi, buddy. And then some black chia seeds. These are my favorites, so I add that to the oatmeal. About a... Um, a tablespoon like that. Yummy. Mix that up. We have an appointment today to go to the doctor for our anatomy scan. So we're going to take you guys with us and probably going to go grab some food afterwards. Show you guys what we eat for lunch and then we'll do the whole dinner thing and so on. But this is the breakfast and these are my carbs that I begin with, with um, about 38 ounces of water with breakfast. So I drink about a gallon of water a day. Need to do the water, don't forget the water, stay hydrated. Um, but yeah, these are my carbs and the carbs that I do consume throughout the day are healthy carbs. You know, they're gonna be oatmeal, rice or sweet potatoes or grits or you know stuff like that bananas stuff from fruit i don't eat processed shit so this is my breakfast so we'll catch you guys at the doctor's office and i don't want to show my face right now because i don't have my makeup done <laughs> love you guys see you soon in front of our doctor's office we're here for our anatomy scan which is an 18 to 20 week scan and uh, look at that woman running over there. Where is she going? What is she the doing? <laughs> She's literally like sprinting. Um, so yeah, we're gonna check the babies and make sure that they look good, the spine looks good, to see how much they weigh and all that good stuff. So um, yeah, so just giving you guys a little update on everything. And then after that, we're gonna go probably get some food and show you guys what we like to eat. Yeah, when yeah. we're out, when we're out, when we're not cooking, when we're out. Right. So. Yeah, because I don't eat out a lot. You know right, what I'm saying? Right. Eat out, period. Nothing. If you catch my drift. Catch y'all in a minute. What's up, y'all? Y'all like them shades? Look at that shirt. Blink, blinking on them. What's up, girl? What you want to talk about? I am just waiting for the doctor to come in so we can start the anatomy scan. It's going down. When the, this is the... Uh, what, is this a mostly extensive test? Well, okay. it's the one that's done between 18 to 20 weeks. Oh, okay. So they measure the babies, look at the spine, and look at the length of the arms, and like everything else, so. So basically what we've been doing, but they just. No, because like, every other time they check how big the cervix is, they don't check how big the babies are. So now we're doing that. I thought um, they checked the brain and if any. Well, the heart and admiralities, right? Like, and then we're gonna check the heart, but that's with the cardiologist, which is gonna be two weeks from now. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Gotcha, gotcha. Exciting. You got the pregnancy glow. Um, it's a good contour, I would say. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, so we already uh, had our appointment, and it was quick because everything was so perfect. out smart and love humanity we ask that you keep blessing over our family watching over our siblings our mothers our fathers amen, amen. so what you got there girl i have a, a dish called you El gotta Jefe. speak up too they can hear me okay um el jefe and it has a whole bunch of bison and here broccoli um rice uh avocado pineapple onions tomatoes Nice. It's a whole bunch of good stuff. And I got the same, I have the same thing without broccoli. But you also have turkey inside as well. Oh yeah, I got turkey too. Yeah. Hey, let's get to it. So you always want to get, the, I use ketchup, but you always want the organic. No high fructose corn syrup, all right? I'm trying to make sure y'all stay healthy.
Kali Muscle, are you full? Nope, I don't eat to get full. Oh, that's right. Guess what? I'm full. <laughs> and the babies are full. Uh, the food was really good. They put too much rice in there though, like, like way too much rice. I love the rice. I need more carbs. Um, but yeah, other than that, like the bison was really, really good. Uh, yeah, until next time, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey guys, so whew, that lunch has like winded me down. Um, I came home and uh, I felt so tired. I tried to work a little bit and answer some emails, and I literally like fell asleep on the couch. So, yeah. I kind of took a nap, so I just got up right now, and I am gonna get a workout in. Um, I try to work out about, you know, at least walk like, you know, for two miles a day, so. Um, but before I do that, um, I will get that on the video. I'm still a little full, but definitely all the food is digested. Um, I wanna talk about Lucy B. Lucy V, thank you so much for sending this. Complimentary, awesome maternity belt and slimming belt. So obviously the slimming belt is not gonna be used until later after the babies are here. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, but then there is this uh, maternity belt and I have noticed that when I'm on the treadmill, it gets a little bit harder um, every time, you know, the belly gets bigger and heavier so this thing hopefully will work to kind of give it a little bit more support so let's check it out Lucy V looks like that pretty cool again thank you so much Ooh, how cute is this packaging Bruce you like that huh come here you like that my Doberman is just like a velcro dog like he's literally with me all the time Yay, so you get these little clips in here, different colors. Lucy, you wanna try the maternity belt? No, don't bite that, no. Come on, buddy, no, no, no. How cute is this little bag? Oh my gosh. Okay, wanna help mommy put it on? Okay, here, you can have this. Let's try it out. Ooh. Okay, come on, here, take this. There you go. Oh wow, okay, so they all come in one size. So the, um, the maternity belt is only in one size. So one size fits all, obviously. I mean, look how big this thing is. And then you can like kind of like loop it through here, it looks like. And then make it to whatever size you, hey, I said no. Um, and then you can loop it through here. So let's try it on before we get on the treadmill. I know this video is supposed to be about food, but I guess I'm just gonna kind of make it like everything in my day today. So let's try it on. Rich, you ready? Ready to try it on? Okay. Let's see here. Get out of my butt. Wow, belly's getting big. Look at that. So let's see how this works. Oh, okay. Make sure it's the proper side. So I guess you kind of cup it because you want the weight to go up a little bit, but not putting pressure, slimming it down. So I'm just gonna go like this. Oh wow, okay, that's cool. And then loop it through. I'm gonna loop it through here. Push. Hi. And then I'm gonna make it to the size that I want it to be, but not putting pressure in the belly, just support. Oh wow, that does help, holy cow. Oh my God. It's like I have freaking 20 pounds lifted off of me. Holy moly, look at that thing. Whew, so that's actually working. So that's 
it's the belly. It has so much support. I can literally like do whatever. So let's get on the treadmill and see how well this is gonna support what I go for my walks. Okay guys, so far so good. I'm really feeling this. I really, really like it. It has a lot of support. You just have to make sure that you're cupping it properly down here. But it is fantastic and I feel like I can actually run. So what I do is I get about two miles in every day, which at this speed takes about 35 minutes maybe or maybe 40, I don't know. My Velcro dog. And hey, I'll see you guys for dinner, right? I'm probably gonna be making some fish. Yeah, I will. I'll be making some fish, so I will see you guys then. So I just finished my workout, as you've seen. Um, it was a very quick one because I don't really lift weights anymore or do anything crazy. Um, so I mostly just focus on cardio um, or like swimming or whatever. But anyways, I did take a quick shower, so it is time for dinner. So I'm gonna be showing you guys what I'm gonna be cooking for dinner. Um, I do have some fish that I'm preparing tonight. I do enjoy eating salmon. Um, that is the only fish that I eat basically regularly and I'm so glad it's allowed during pregnancy so you are allowed to have salmon you know once or uh, once or every couple of weeks um, eight to ten ounces so it's very low in mercury almost none um, and also as far as seafood I do enjoy shrimp another thing that I'm allowed to have so tonight we're having salmon so I'm gonna get to cook that um, yeah, so every night, I mean, it's different. Usually I have chicken or I, I make something that, you know, I prepared for the next like two days or whatever, but tonight it just happens to be salmon. So it is about 6.30 right now. So I'm pretty sure that I'm gonna be hungry because I go to bed like around 11 o'clock at night. So between now, and 11 o'clock I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be hungry again so I will be showing you guys um, and sharing with you like what kind of snack I'm gonna have probably some fruit or some or some nuts or something but anyways I will get it on video so you guys can see like all day what I eat and you know a day in pregnancy to see what I do so let's get to it and start cooking some fish all right, first thing is first, let's chop some broccoli. I have decided to do some more carbs, and that is healthy carbs, of course. So I have some sweet potato right here that I'm chopping, and this is going to be going into my air fryer. And don't forget your water. Stay hydrated at all times. It is time to get the fish ready. I have washed my fish. I am going to prep it right now and put some seasoning on it. Um, you can basically put anything you like on there. Um, I mix mine with just the things that I enjoy. I don't use any salt because clearly you do not need any extra sodium when you're pregnant. Well guys, that is my dinner, which is right here. 
um, a little bit of sweet potatoes, a little bit of broccoli, and about six or maybe eight ounces of salmon. Um, it's about 7.15 right now. I'm gonna eat, and then I'm gonna show you guys what my snack is later. Um, you know, just remember, you know, they say, you know, eat carbs with every meal, sure, but you don't need to eat carbs, like the crazy carbs, like buns and bread and pasta and all that other shit. Like, I can't, I mean, I, I don't, I don't. And I don't even have crazy, like, cravings. Like, this is, this is what I crave, like, my food that I make. Like, I crave this all the time. Um, and just remember, just because you're pregnant does not mean you have to eat for two or in my, um, in my case for three people <laughs> you don't that is when you get in trouble you don't want to eat you want to eat for yourself get yourself not even full get yourself to a, 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 a comfortable stage you know what I mean like eat often as often as you can throughout the day and don't get yourself full because that heartburn is a no freaking joke seriously um, anyway so I don't you know force feed myself so um, even though <laughs> half of this is probably gonna get me really full because I can't really eat that much anymore. The babies are getting pretty big in there, you know? As time goes on, it's only gonna get harder. Um, anyways, I'll show you guys my snack, um, and yeah, we'll go from there. What's up with a little mind, what you fixing? Hey, so uh, I'm making myself a snack. I uh -huh. am starving. Yeah. It is, what is it? It's huh? 10 o'clock, I'm having a mango. And I'm also gonna have a nectarine, which is You're supposed to be eating this late, huh? Well, yeah. Yeah, okay. So, um, anyways, this is my favorite fruit, by the way. So, I love nectarines. I don't know what I'm gonna do, because summer is almost over, mm -hmm. and it's gonna be a disaster. So, mm -hmm. when I have a mango in that, and then I usually have some nuts. Oh, yeah, we know you have a lot of them. Nuts, right? Yeah! And that's my snack, right? So, this is my last meal of the day, pretty much, until... I decide to get up or something, right? Okay, what's your doggy doing? Um, he's watching. What's your doggy doing over there? He's watching intervention. <laughs> <laughs> no, he was looking outside. Hey, Brucey. Bruce, what up, boy? Say what's up to YouTube, man. Facebook, Instagram. Say what's up to everybody on social media. Huh? Okay. Yeah, that's our boy. That's our boy. Let's finish off over here, see what we got. So how you cut it? Um, huh? I'm just gonna uh, take a knife. Mm -hmm. uh, first of all, I have to peel it all the way. Oh, what's the doggy doing? Look at the doggy, huh? Let's give him some cabra tie. You want some cabra tie, huh? Hey, hey, what are you doing? What you doing, man? You tried to bite me, man? Don't bite me, man. Okay? I don't want to have to do you like Brooke Hawk. Yeah, yeah. Oh, God. Oh, he's violent. Oh, don't be so violent. Oh, no, we what? never spit on our dog. <laughs> okay. I don't even know. I, I don't even know how to build it up. Like a loogie? Yeah, you gotta be disgusting. You gotta have a cold. <laughs> yeah. She had a cold. She had a cold. <laughs> I am horrible at cutting mango. It is like the most awkward thing in the world to Why, cut. Baby? Why? Because it's slippery and it has like an awkward. Slippery when wet. <laughs> yeah, isn't that like a Guns N' Roses song? Uh. Oh, I don't wanna cut it though. See what I mean? Like it's so weird. Oh, yeah. Maybe you should keep the skin on it. No, you can't oh, keep that, the skin on. Then just peel I mean, the skin from around it. No, you're making it more complicated that way. Okay. Anyways, let me taste it. Mmm. <laughs> Yummy. <laughs> tastes really good. What's wrong with this focus? I gotta get that new camera. And then I'm gonna have this. So. <clears throat> oh, this is a little bitter. Anyways, I think I got a little bit of the, what do you call this thing? Mango seed? Yeah. Oh, you, um, so. I don't want to throw this away, so I kind of work around it. That's cool. That's cool. Um, so anyway, this is it for me. Um, I'm gonna go to bed. Going to bed, good night.
upstairs. Let me say good night to the people too. Okay, if y'all can see me. Look at though. Look at that. Look at that. This light ain't good, man. Gotta see my biceps looking like. Boom! Let me get some. Ooh, ooh, there it is. There goes them good light. Yeah. You have to eat around it. Mmm. <laughs> Peace, y'all. We we'll see you on the next one, baby. Hit that subscribe button. We're trying to get to 100,000, man. We need y'all help. Please help us. We always help y'all, giving y'all good entertainment. So it's about to be a lot of entertainment with the babies. So please hit that subscribe button. We love y'all. And we'll see you on the next one. Yeah. Happy family. Say, yeah, yeah, yeah.